Watch your head. Wolf? No. That ain't wolves. I know what wolves help. Start putting some heavy sticks around because it will start shifting after everything that fucking burns. Hey Joe. Yeah. I'm gonna go around a quick governor, so. Alright, you got your comms on you? Yeah. Okay. I'm uh I'm gonna leave my bag here too. Alright. It's got a lot of equipment in it, so just make sure you got your comms on your check in once in a while. Yep, we'll do. Joe, come in. Copy. Joe. We got a big dog out here. Joe, come in. We're not alone out here. Two sets of tracks. I repeat, we have two sets of tracks. We are not alone out here. Keep your head on a swivel. I'm going to check out this old vehicle up ahead. It looks pretty run down, but I'm gonna check it out and see if, we've, if I can find anything. All right, and then I'll be right back. Sets of nail tracks, human tracks. There's some commotion over there. We got some big fucking doggy prints. salvaging for today.
food truck. Hey, Joe. Found the old logging camp. Also, found the truck. I don't think we're gonna be able to drive out of here with this thing. It's roached, like roached. Looks like someone blew it up. This area is filled with trip wires as well. We just went around a couple of them. I'm getting the fuck out of here. We'll establish a new base camp if we have to. I'll be regrouping with you. I'm on my way. What was that, dude? You didn't hear any of my comms? No. Oh, son of a bitch. We're not alone out here. We're set a perimeter. we fucking sitting ducks out here. Was that you shooting earlier? No. I thought we were the only ones fucking out here, dude. No. We're not. That noise? There was one night I heard the same noise. But I'm not exactly sure what it is. It's almost kind of grunts like I'm coming for you type deal. Right. Like yeah. I think you told me something about that too. Mm -hmm. I heard it. And uh, I saw two sets of tracks, and then I saw this other set of tracks. It looked like a dog, but God. they were like the size of my fucking head pressed into the ground. Tell me when we're in a better area, dude. We're fucking... Those gunshots were close. Well, they weren't towards us because there was three shots. They could be. They could be towards yeah. us. They were distant. Those tracks that I saw were a few hours old. Let's get the fuck out of here. Let's rack off and head back to HQ. Snowstorm's going away. Yeah. Too bad tonight. Keep this fire going over the fucking freezer. I need to form shelter up here. You seriously thought that was me shooting back there? Yeah. I thought we were the only ones out here. No. I radioed in to you. I wasn't getting up. <laughs> All right, so I'll tell you what I've seen. This area is rigged with traps. I was out by an old truck prior. Saw two sets of traps. About size nine and a half. The other one maybe size thirteen. Yeah. They were kind of splitting off into a direction. Yeah, one cup of drink out of the they were uh, splitting yeah. off into one of the two different directions. And then as I was approaching the other side tracks, there were like big fucking dog prints. Like the, si like the prints were the size of my fucking face. Mm -hmm. Imprinted in this. They're huge. And they were just kind of like. I think it'd be an oversized Timberwolf. 
if it had to have been like something like the side of a fucking bear because the traps are fucking ass up. Okay. But there was more than one loadout, yeah, meaning go. there was more than one pair of traps. Right. So whatever it was, it was in a pack. Here, you can have this. I don't, I don't want the truck. Oh, okay. But... Yeah, what's going on? Yeah, I'm sorry, I haven't been, you know, hanging out. I haven't had fun out in a while. I've just been working. You know, I haven't had time for anything, really. Nah, dude, you're good. Just miss having you hanging around, you know? Yeah, I know. I know I do too, man. I, I really do miss hanging out. Hey, quick question for you, dude. You busy right now? I mean, I was going to study, but I don't see why not, you know, I can come on down. Yeah, I'm sure. I mean, I can get a fire going if you want. That's up to you, dude. Oh, hell yeah, man. I'm down. I'll, I'll come on down for that. All right, man. I'll see you soon. Sweet. All right, bye.
lot, dude. Not a lot. Where's the Jetta? Nah. Sold it. I'm just driving my pop truck around a little bit right now. Damn, dude. Yeah. Oh, I got my new toy. What is that? Balls in the dance. I put the scope on it myself. Bad for a little scout rifle. Thanks. It's new. I don't have a whole lot to be honest with you. You're from Matt lately? No. Still not. Damn hey, many though. Yeah, it's nice to have a fire for once. I'm stuck inside all winter, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I hear you there. Notice you cleaned up around here a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. And really I uh, closed down my bladesmithy business, so huh. got more free time. We had Matt down here to clean this whole freaking place up. Yeah. Speaking of which, you, like I asked earlier, you hearing from him lately or no? No, I haven't. I was going to ask you the same thing. I think he's still messing around with that watch. I think he might be. I don't know, but gut feeling. Been having any nightmares lately? After our our jump? No, to be honest, no. I just have this funny feeling that something's not right. Lately, I haven't been able to sleep. I keep, I don't know. I keep hearing that ticking noise from that clock, that watch. Even in the broad daylight, I'll just be sitting doing nothing, and all I hear is that. It's like, where the fuck is it coming from? You know. Hey. Ever since then, it just seems like it may be correlated with what's been going on with Matt. It's just been missing. I really don't want to talk about it. I mean, other than the fact of why I asked you why if you've had any nightmares or anything like that. Because I've been having nightmares about it. But at the same time, I still can't wrap my head around it to the point where I'm afraid to even talk about it. You know? I don't blame you on that. Well, I kind of got to get going. I got to go meet up with my pops. All right, dude. So. Nice to see you. I'll probably be back down again. We gotta figure out what's going on. Alright, so. Do you wanna come back down later tonight? Or uh, whenever you get done helping your pops? I gotta hold you. Alright. Alright, man. Have a good day. Yeah, you too, dude. Drive safe, alright? Yeah, will do.
Hey, what up? trying to get a hold of Matt to be a douchebag. I doesn't get a hold of me either. Oh. I texted him like 12 fucking times. Called him 11 fucking times within three days. You think by now he would have answered? I mean, seriously. What the fuck is crawling up his ass? I don't know. How much do you want to bet he's using that watch again? Probably. I wasn't thinking it's something against us. It's just he's very busy doing something that's not good. Uh, I got figures. It's not cold out today. Yeah, it is. So, how you like it? Yeah, mostly. It's something, dude. It's awesome. Uh, is it going to hold up, though? Probably not. But, I mean, it's been windy out lately, so in the meantime, it's still pretty good. That's good. Yeah. I'll get a fire. Sure. But in the old grill because it's too windy out. Yeah, I don't, I don't blame you there. I might need some gasoline. So, this is all the wood we got? Yeah. Well, I think when you tend to the fire, I'm going to go grab some out there in the woods. in your hands. Why are you so winded? Listen, dude. Whatever's out there, demonic, witch, whatever, you know, whatever you want to call it. The almost ungodful sound I heard out there. What did you hear? I don't know. It was just demonic, witch, ghoul, whatever the, I don't know, something right out of a book, dude. Right out of a movie. Yeah. I'll have my phone on me.
damn it. Ah! I had enough of this shit. What the fuck? Yo. My door's locked. How'd you even get in? You did not, did you not hear me teleport? I was like teleporting right out there. Oh, you could teleport, I forgot about that. Jesus Christ, I'm sorry. It's been a rough week. What's up? So, I've been gone for a while, clearly, because uh, it looks like s spring, obviously, right? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's getting there. You know, Syracuse, though. <laughs> it's gonna fucking, it's supposed to snow tonight. <laughs> I don't even have my phone with me anymore. <laughs> well, whatever, I mean, oh, that's surprising. You usually have one. Yeah. So, you know, you, the reason why, you know why I've been gone for so long, right? You're fighting a war. Well, kind of. Uh, well, so the last few months I've been actually searching the multiverse because uh, remember, remember how I told you about the journal where it showed all the stones and, like, the properties and well, shit? Yeah, yeah. Now, I found something out there that is kind of scary, but then I also found some of the stones. Is that a game changer? What the fuck? So, what's next? What, 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 what are you gonna, why, what's up? Now, I don't wanna show you Everything well. I'll show you this. So. Man, that looks fucking ancient. What's up with it? <sighs> fucking want to it. This shit is like beyond brutal. Now, when I found this, the paper was actually soaking wet. So. What'd you do? Take a torch to it? <laughs> <laughs> no, it was no, it was. So I've been finding buildings in the yeah. You see that? That I is that is that the, the the watch? I don't know. It looks just like the watch. It's a childhood but... teleporting device, or whatever. And then this definitely is the watch. That looks just like the watch. Right. And then all this shit's in a different language. So there's the stones. Yeah, I can I can kind of tell which ones are the stones. I can tell that one is the stone of clarity, and I can tell that is the healing stone. And then that is the stone of strength. And right. I can only assume that's a soul, so what is, what a soul is, stone. What is it? Does it just harness the crystals? I mean, it's just... It's, I don't know what that is. Looks like it's like... Uh, now, now, listen, there's this too. That I found this one is pretty bad. The writing is so screwed up because it's all... Like almost rotted in a way. Cause right. It's, it was like it was sitting. It was wet. It was like soaking wet when I found it in the structures. So and there's a year on this though. That, that that looks just like the watch, but it's like it almost looks like it's like a different version of the watch. You see how there's like two different clocks on this and shit. Yeah. And then there's an actual year. What like timelines or something? Yeah. Either the year either says 1806 or 1886. So, so what's the deal? Like, why, why are you bring this to me? I don't know. I thought that I would just show you. Well, I mean, it, it's it's next level, next level stuff. I don't know what to tell you. I I found. I just found this. You think this is gonna help you? What I mean, I have no clue. And that's right. The reason why I actually came out here was because well, first I need to ask you a favor. Oh, favors. This one actually is going to be quite a doozy. What do you mean? What is this? Just in case. Just in case. Just in case of Big Brother. Don't really say anything. But you got people coming after you now. I don't know. Just in case. <laughs> so what's up with this? What do you need me for? So. You have all these parts. I already know that. Oh, I do? You already have these parts. I... Well, never mind how I So you mean to tell me you, you want me to put this fucking thing together? Yeah, what I have it? every single every single thing listed. All what the pieces. Is what is this? What is it going to do? Now, 
So these stones, if it functions like an actual soul stone with being able to harness them, then building like this machine, so to speak, is going to be a host for all these stones. Is it a weapon? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. All right. How long do you need? How, do you, how long do I have? Now, I have a few formulas formulas listed out like for certain like properties of energy just to you know that way you could kind of get a grasp of exactly what it means or what it's going to do okay but i just it it harnesses all it harnesses all the stones so if everything is put in precisely what's it going to do create some kind of fucking sonic blast i'm assuming yeah. Like something. So that right there, that's the power meter. That's okay. the target rod. Right. That's obviously the heat displacement. Right. right there is the quartz reservoir. That's going to be where all the, um, that's where we're going to do. That's, that's where all the essence is going to be. Um, that's going to be an essence handle. It's obviously conductive. It's metal. It's going to be metal. Right. There's the positive and negative on the back, and then there's a small circuit board. I know you have the circuit board somewhere. Yeah. You recognize it, don't you? Yes, I do. And there's a bunch of formulas written down here, too. I'm going to take that out of the cell phone. Yep. All this thing really is is one big capacitor. Yeah. And um, a lot of the most of the uh, body on the top of it is heat displacement. So if you have some sort of like a laptop fan, maybe, yeah. compu any any sort of com computer fan, you could... Well, you know me. A I'm an electronic junker. So I'm thinking, give me, give me a couple of days, maybe a week, tops. All right. I think I got this. Uh, Just don't, whatever you do, don't try to dry fire it. I'll get a phone. A phone? So I can fucking contact you. If I need you, yeah. information, whole nine yards, you better get one. You need I'll, mine? No, I'll look for my phone. I'll look oh, for mine it's somewhere. Fucking Christ. All right. I have to think of... It might be at Roxas, honestly. I left a lot of my stuff there. How are they doing? You got them on their fucking toes, too? You do it, don't Probably. you? Probably. Fucking motherfucker. They're probably going to be pissed to see that. I think my phone is at her house, you know? Yeah. But well, listen, yo, I gotta head out. I know you stupid fuck. Alright, you got this. Love you. Oh, Keep it real. Jesus. Sorry, bear hug, you know. Alright. <laughs> Don't tell anyone that. I right? won't say a word. You know me. I hate everybody. Ooh. The watch hasn't been doing good lately. Alright, All right, I'll see you. Peace. You gotta walk? <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Yo, what up? Don't you ever fucking do that again. Dude, I'm just trying to forget. Sorry, I'm fucking angry. Dude, chill. I'm really fucking angry at you. You know that, right? There's been a lot of shit going on out here, and you've never... We've been trying to get a hold of you. I don't have my phone. I don't know where it is. I, I couldn't take it with... I couldn't just, like, come back for it. I don't even really know where it is. I figure it's kind of, like here somewhere because I was here you know the last time you know I was like living here just here listen all right so the reason why I was gone for so long and the reason why I didn't come back is, you got a lot of explaining to do all right so before anything <clears throat> I found these take a look at it 
You're fucking kidding me. Oh, you actually found them. I found two of them. Two of the, two of the three. Where's the other one? You're fucking joking. Which stone is this? That is the stone of strength. And that's the stone of healing. Yeah. So that means there's two more. There's one more. One. There's two more, but technically one more. The there's the soul stone. I assume that like comes from an actual like essence of some sort, right? Of someone, yeah. Mm -hmm. But <sighs> okay, well, you got them. Now what? I stumbled upon buildings, like actual buildings in the multiverse. You're fucking like, joking. Like someone or something like built something and that's um that's where I found one of the stones and then the other stone I found um there was a bridge and then like a small island on a big fucking creek and that's where I found the other stone. <coughs> but I haven't seen the Peace Lord at all. Not Speaking of the Peace Lord, Joe and I had some fucked up experiences lately, and it's got us on edge. What do you mean? During the winter time, Joe and I we went out in the wind. We went out in the snow time, the winter. Went out in the woods, about 15, 20 miles out. We were gonna do a little bit of hunting and stuff, and then unfortunately, we don't fucking know what the hell it was. I saw tracks. And I heard like this low, deep, raspy voice, like sandpaper across your face type concept. But like when it spoke, you could like feel it through you. And it was saying, I'm coming for you. That's what it said? And I heard growling. And then I'm, like I heard gunshots in the woods. So clearly we weren't the only ones out there. But still, it just out of nowhere. And we ran. I ran back up to like our little base camp we had set up with our little fire and everything. And Joe was already got his gun ready because he thought it was me making pop shots at something. Yeah. Uh, and oh. then not that long ago afterwards, it was like a couple of weeks ago, give or take. What's that? I found this in one of the old buildings. The building was like dilapidated, but here. Take a look at those. That's in a different language, obviously, so you're gonna have to decipher it. But I, I don't know. It's Latin. Uh, yeah. I I can't read Latin, so you know what to do. You deciphered the um. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that right now. I got a lot of shit to, to do. I gotta get those radios up and running for a customer of mine, but. All right. I'll take a look at these later, all right? All right. I'm sorry I snapped at you. Dude, you know? it's fine. I I mean, I should have come back, but it's, I, I shouldn't have it the same time. Because <coughs> when you teleport, you know, there's I mean, like a pattern to the teleporting. I didn't want to break the pattern. Yeah, it, it spooked the fuck out of me, all right? And you got to understand I'm pissed because there's just a lot of shit that's been going on. A couple weeks ago, Joe and I were going to have a fire and we were trying to get a hold of you. And next thing you know, he went out to go get some firewood, and he got chased all the way up here. Hmm. He didn't even, he was freaking the fuck out. And I've been having a lot of flashbacks about... What happened? Yeah, sure. when the Peace Lord showed up well, and tried attacking us the first time. Uh, the, 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 the nightmares have been By the way, constant. the reason why I've been looking for the stones is because I am trying, I'm in the process of building a weapon. I'm I don't think you're going to be able to kill it. I mean, this thing is beyond our world. I, there's nothing, there's nothing else I could do. I mean, you said that, I mean, I experienced that. I shot it in the face and... I mean, so did we. I mean, bullets stop them a little bit, but it didn't kill them. Yeah. It's because of the healing stone. If it can just heal over and over, then you can't kill it. And it's not like I can just take its power away because I don't have its power. I figured if I can build that weapon, maybe maybe that maybe, thing can take it down. Maybe it could weaken them enough. I don't know. I told... I, I drew... Who's working on the prototype for you, then? I... 
I drew schematics on a piece of paper and you know with some formulas written down and I gave it to Mike and I explained a little bit of it to him. A lot of anybody that knows anything about weapon based if, it, if it, this thing is mechanical or if it's electrical he's the only fucking it's... gearhead that I know that can probably build this thing so you probably get your best bet there. Well, it's a I capacitor mean, based um, guy's a former contractor for Christ's sakes. I mean, and he builds guns in a bunker. Yeah. Even though your cousin's a little. Yeah. He's the only one that can get shit done. So I'm really tired. Like, really tired. Would you mind if I slept in the shanty? Because I want to sleep really bad. And then I can probably look for my phone. Then, if it still works. Worst comes worse, I have a spare phone for you, my old cell phone. If you can't find it, you can just get it. Re get my flip phone activated. It's nothing special. As for All sleeping right. in the shanty, though, I don't really know about that. I don't have a house anymore, dude. That's long gone. Yeah, unless any of your parents moved away and the house that you were used to live in was demolished. Well, the reason I've been, since I came back, I changed my clothes and uh, my room is no more. So the house wasn't demolished? I've been no. hearing rumors from everybody else that uh, like they, your house just got trashed. No. Hmm. Okay. My room's just, my room basically is a storage closet now. It's like, if Oh, so you parents did renovations. Okay. Yeah, I, I mean, I didn't go outside of my room. I teleported into a junkyard in my room. That's all it was. Would you mind if I stayed in the shanty, though, seriously, for, like, a few days? And then, you know, maybe... Oh, all right, three days in the shanty, but if you really need a place to stay, you can stay, but you're going to have to pull your weight. Yeah, I know. I have a spare bedroom, but my grandma is not going to let you live for free. I'm not going to live for free. Jesus. Right. And maybe Joe can get you a job. Yeah. And I am actually looking to hire another person. So. Alright. Pays like shit, but. It'll let work. me know. Just let me know when you get the shit um, figured out with the papers. <coughs> This. Yeah, I know. <sighs> All right, I'll talk to you in the morning, dude. All right, man. I'm gonna, hey, by the way, I'm going to take a crack at that in a little bit. All right. Hopefully I can get some answers for you. All right, I'll see you. All right, good night. Germany.
the Germans were building this. Longitude. They all work on time travel. <laughs> kind of reminds me of when Boyd said, What is this like back to the future type shit? I mean, it's fucking right now at this point because. This is 1886. These are latitude, longitude. And then these are dates. Okay, these are the original schematics after the Bell Project. I need to jot that down. To understand the true definition of 359, you'd have the key to the universe in your hands. This is fucking deep. stuff to work with. sleep? I've been here the whole time. I've discovered the meaning of teleportation. What do you mean, dude? There's a real answer in life. Forty-two. The Nazis is working on a device for teleportation. Their new wounds were blocked. They failed. They they didn't know how to really get it to work. They had an Italian scientist by the name of Dori. Um, in nineteen fifty-two, he started working with NASA and he started redoing this obsession of teleportation. He realized that there was an algorithm to utilize. The algorithm is utilized between each and every different type of eclipse and every type of moon pattern and certain alignments of stars and alignments of pa uh, planets. Like for some, in some cases you might be able to see Venus or some shit like that, but he was able to utilize an algorithm timing it just right and Nikola Tesla originally said if you could truly understand the definition of 359 you'd have the key to the universe in your hands well here's the interesting thing I got lucky at it, and I finally managed to decipher Vittori's crazy little fucking encryption 359 is debatable on how many times you turn that knob 
in a certain type of eclipse or a certain type of moon alignment, like it might be a full moon, you go and you twist it about maybe three, five times, or nine times, and you press the button like Matt does. This is the actual watch that Matt owns. This is the real fucking deal. Well, where did you even get these anyways? He found them in the multiverse. These papers. He even said that there were even buildings there. When did when did you see Matt? He portal jumped here last night. Are you serious? He's sleeping in the shanty. So I figured it out, and I I I'm not gonna be able to describe it here, but I figured it out here. So this there's a stone inside of it. This doesn't. Okay, but. Somewhere along the lines, Vittori realized what he did wrong. So he recreated the watch, but a different way. Kind of like a stock watch. And it's just a little bit more stable. And a little more simpler, too. I get it, because a regular old-school style wind-up gyro-operated fucking watch is big. They wouldn't be able to hold the capacity. Anyways, so he decided, okay... 3, 5, and 9 are the times of winding it, and blah, 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 and etc. of the moon and the sun, or the solar eclipse and lunar eclipse. So you twist, go, and it opens up a doorway, kind of like a wormhole, and you're able to literally just doof, disappear. And next thing you know, you're in the multiverse, but in order for it to work, I kept the notes, and that's also what I was getting into, the multiverse when you're jumping you, it's affected by those solar and lunar eclipses and needs to be timed right so but this now Einstein believed not even Einstein but Nikola Tesla as well believed that the earth is this giant battery well that was the original originally the Nazis had the same theory that maybe you used the earth as the power source that's what they got wrong no what really is is the earth has a bunch of micro frequencies that it actually emits and when you go into a meditative state you're able to actually tap that the only way for the jumping or you know for a wormhole to open up that way you have to go into a blank mind state where there's no thoughts except where you want to go and it will take you there and that's the way that watch works now, I originally, when I was thinking of this, I was thinking, okay, wouldn't this need a different type of power source, like energy, like a soul gem, for example, mm -hmm. like Matt was telling me about. No, it has its own it's gem like inside. It's, it's a power source that's called the, the Stone of Time. And that Vittori had to create. I don't think he actually created it because if these were found in the multiverse, and that means he might have stole it. Because he disappeared. Nobody knows where he went to. It's almost mind blowing. Because you're looking at it and you're like, what? Yeah. And think of it this way 1942, 1942, 1953. That's a huge time gap, if you ask me, but these are the only papers that are of existence. Hell, these should be destroyed, actually. But like, the, these were a flawed design, and the Nazis were like, what the fuck? It doesn't work. Yeah. And they usually have a tendency of burning their old documents so nobody can get their hands on them. This guy fucking took off with them when he sided with the Allies. And now we're into the final problem final problem that's been solved. I figured it out because he's using encryptions in the Ohio when it comes to cryptology. And he had one little small problem. Numeric code and Latin. Clever bastard. But I was able to crack it. So these are the different stones and those stones are used every time 
when the, that thing, the Peace Lord, when it jumps from one part of the multiverse to the next, there's these gems, these stone things. Matt found a couple of them, actually. I believe a red one and like a like an amber colored one, which I believe is the stone of strength and the stone of healing. And it's either one of these ones. I know the big one's the, obviously the healing one because it even says it in Latin right there. But it's able to heal him. It's kind of like he is the, the watch. So he uses his energy to jump, okay? Then from there, he has to kind of like recuperate, kind of like, I guess you could say, eat something and drink a glass of water to, so you're not feeling a little like, woo, you know what I mean? And even says in here, I don't think Matt knows this, but I know he said something about this, so this kind of validates what he was thinking. So his theory is correct. These can be weaponized to kill him. This thing, this peace lord, there's a way, and it's written right here in fucking encrypted messaging in Latin, but with numeric code, with these codes down here. It was the actual equation to make this thing work. But who, who would even be the one to build something of this magnitude? The only person I know who's not only former, but also para military, his cousin. And you know how he is. He literally lives in a fucking oh, bunker. Mike? You know how he lives in the goddamn bunker, makes guns all day long. And he knows a lot. Well, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, but he's the only person I know that can probably make this thing happen. And in fact, I think he already talked to him, so. Guaranteeing it. But here's the thing you have to be able to amplify a frequency that these stones produce. And then you need some form of power source. The soul gem. You got one shot to use this, and it is more powerful than a goddamn nuke when it goes off. It has the ability to vaporize somebody, dematerialize them to a nanomolecular level, meaning you can't even see with a fucking nanoscope. And those are some powerful fucking microscopes. There's literally gone. So, if Matt weaponizes this thing, he needs to be very, very careful. Yeah, because I mean, one wrong move, pointing it in the wrong way, it could just blow up in his fucking face. And next thing you know, he's the one that gets dematerialized. I've been up all night long trying to crack Vittori's code. Find me. I think I got it. Oh, good job. I haven't moved from this spot since like 8 o'clock last night. And I have a pounding headache because I am like dead to the world. And if you could, bring me a pot of coffee as strong as road tar. Give me two Tylenol and a glass of water with lemon juice in it. I'm going to actually go upstairs because I'm afraid that I might have soiled myself in the process last night of working here because I didn't do anything at all. Well, I'll get that done for you, but um, I had to go get my workout in. I, you know, I just got up about an hour ago myself. Um, I'm going to go say hi to Matt. I haven't seen the fucker in a long time, you know? Okay. So I'm going to wake his ass up. All right. All right. Careful there. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. What's up, dude? What? How you been? Where have you been? Multiverse. Multiverse, huh? Yeah. Oh. It's fucking morning. 
what time is it? Um, I don't even have my I don't have a watch or anything. Here's the one with the fancy watch, I thought. Uh, I, didn't, I didn't have my phone the whole time because I lost it, but I found it last night. Does the thing still even work? Yeah, the charger was in here, so I charged it. I mean... Makes sense, you got it in the fall and you barely even used it. You used it like once. Yeah. I've been in the multiverse the entire time. So... That's crazy. His rock's up. Yeah. I got I got her up. Uh, when I went in there, she was like passed out on the table, decoding and looking at all this, you know, weird shit of teleportation and demur de dematerialization and all that. And, yeah. But like, you know, I just woke up an hour ago myself, so a little too much for me right now, but. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, I found some of the stones out there. I still have to find one more, so. Well, you got two now? I found the Stone of Healing and the Stone of Strength. And obviously those papers that she was taking a look at. Right. But that's all I found. Did I, did she mention to you that I found fucking buildings? Yes. Yep. Oh, somebody fucking built an actual building out there. And there's, like, not just buildings, but structures. Like, there was a bridge that I crossed, and I don't know. It just, it looks like, you know, there have obviously been people there, so. Hmm. Or, so you're not the only one that's been there. I guess not, maybe. Or I don't, I don't really know, to be honest with you. I haven't seen the Peace Lord at all. Which is weird. Cause the last time, you know, I was jumping through the multiverse, it followed me everywhere. Yeah, you were like his main target. Yeah, it just, it, every world I went to, it would try killing me, basically. But, yeah. So what, what goes on from here? I don't know. I gotta find the last stone and uh, oh yeah that's right I'm building a fucking weapon I wrote or I drew out schematics for the, this fucking capacitor based weapon and he's having crazy Mike do it yeah it's going to charge itself like the stones power it like so the way I'm doing it is the weapon functions off of you so if I were to take in all the stones, I could use the weapon. I could charge the weapon from myself. Sure. Yeah, from my own essence. So I could, you know, I, it's going, as far as I know, it should, it should be able to kill the Peace Lord. If it doesn't fucking blow up in my hands. Yeah. I told I told Mike not to dry fire it, like just to build it and give it to me, and that's it. Brox uh, filled me in. He made she made sure to fill me in on the um, on the dangers of the weapon. Yeah, for sure. <sighs> what are you doing? Uh, I came here to work out, and I usually like to go inside, wake her up. I didn't expect to find her at the table, though, with a bunch of, uh, you know, schematics and, you know. So, yeah, I think my day is going to drastically change from what's happened this morning. I have my phone. I used the Wi-Fi last night to text Mike and... He's going to set me up on his plan, so I'll be good for now okay. until I can actually get to a store. I kind of seen that the world is gone to shit. The world's a lot different from last time I seen it. Uh, I was gone, I think, six months. 
the world's a lot different now, dude. Yeah. That's insane. I want to go inside and take a shower. All right, man. That's probably much needed. Oh, I'm fucking stiff as hell. Yo. Hey. What are you doing? I am marking a wing leg. Wing leg? Yeah. Uh, a friend of mine a while back. Aren't you like supposed to not like even touch lead? What's in bullets? Hey, fair enough. I finished the... Remember the pipe you had me fix? Yeah. I, I, I was able to fix it. One of the connection points was oh. loose. Yeah, it was just kind of like jangling around and then I just lifted the whole bottom part up and then screwed it in and then it was fine. Sweet. It needed Teflon tape though. So... Was it the metal pipe? Yeah. Alright, give me a second. Oh, this is gonna be shitty, whatever. Oh, this is 3 LBS, so good enough. Um, is there anything else you need me to do? Because I kinda, I, I gotta get out of here. I gotta get the mics, dude. And that I'm being serious about. I've been here for two months straight. I've been working your ass like a dog. Yeah, you're not wrong about that. I can't really think of anything else. So, I think you're pretty much set. Alright. I am worried about the Peace Lord, though, so the sooner you can get that package, the better. Well, you had the alarm system, right? You, you got it done. It doesn't work right. It keeps drifting the breakers.
I just got a bad feeling that it's going to show up unexpectedly. Well, keep the alarm system on. I'll try, but like I said, it keeps, tr it keeps blowing circuits and tripping breakers, so I don't know how good it's really going to be. Well, we got it to work that one time, so yeah, and you then, never know. And I had to get a couple new fuses afterwards. You think you'll be all right? Cause I I texted Joe earlier. He said he said he'll be down here. I mean, you know bullets can't kill this thing. They can slow it down. Yeah, it'll slow I'll it. Be, it'll, slow, it'll slow it down, but it ain't gonna kill it. Well, how about this? I'll stop at my house. See if I got any clothes, cause I don't have a whole lot of clothes left. You know that. And I'm gonna go to Mike's, pick the cargo up, and then I'll head to the Crusher. And come to here from there because it would be faster all right because if i were to just like teleport like with the watch it, i'd probably it'd probably take till sundown for me to get back here where the crusher i'll be back in a little bit so all right try to be here as fast as you can no dilly dallying or anything like that i got a bad feeling well and i've learned over the years to trust my gut so Alright, dude. I'll see you in a bit. Alright, dude. Take it easy. See you on the flip side. Don't blow yourself up. Yo, yo, what the fuck? Why do you keep doing that shit? It's appearing out of nowhere. Are you asleep? Yeah, man. Well, I'm here. I need the weapon. The weapon? Yeah. The one I built? Did you, yeah, did you, you actually built it? Yeah, but, uh, there's something about it. Chassis's not stable enough to get the whole the energy together. Like, it's gonna blow up. You're gonna fucking kill yourself. I'll, you can't, you can't use it. I'll take a look at it. I'll take a look at it. I, I highly you suggest push. you don't do it. Like, no. I do. do but you, you know, you're headstrong, you're stubborn, but whatever, man. We don't have a choice. Do. I know. I it's guess. either this or dying. You're done. You're done. You're, you're probably done. Fuck, do what you gotta do. You gotta save the world. I don't have a choice, dude. The Peace Lord uses the stones together. And if I use the stones together, you know. It's got the big old quartz reservoir in it. I'm sure. So you're telling me that everybody involved has to trust this. And I'm the one that built the fucking thing. And I know it's not going to be stable. Just gonna be like no one really trusts. I don't trust it fully, but I don't have a choice. I don't think she cares. She cares. <laughs> Listen, this is serious. I gotta get. I gotta. I gotta get back there. Cause I don't want the peace lord to fucking appear there while I'm gone. Get gone. It's on the porch. It's on the porch. Well, I'm gonna teleport from here to the rock crusher, because clearly sometimes the past is teleporting. You know. Distance really doesn't work. Like time still passes. It. So I'm gonna teleport to the crusher, and then I'll teleport from the crusher to Roxas, so that way it'll be faster. All right. Do you feel All right. I'm here. In the back. I'll let me know. All right. Get your cell phone. <laughs> Alright, I'll, I'll see you around, dude. Don't die. I'm not going. Alright. But I'll let, I'll let you know if anything happens. Alright? Yeah. Alright, I'll talk to you later. Going back to sleep. Yeah, go back to sleep. Yep.
like um, our odds right now. What do you mean? It's got a bad feeling. Uh, the peace lord? Yeah. What are you feeling? I think something bad's gonna happen. I don't know what it is. I, I, you know how you just gotta trust your gut? Yeah. My gut's saying something bad's gonna happen. I don't know what, but it's like a calm before the storm. And it's gonna be a nasty fucking storm. Well, what have you done to prepare? <clears throat> Tried everything. Tried getting that defense system up and running. You know, the security grid keeps failing. Running low on ammunition. And I know bullets barely even fucking touch this thing, and that's all I have. Maybe 10, 12 gauge rounds, a couple of 308s. I'm cracking into the old shit. Because I don't have anything else. Well, we just got to make do with what we got for now, unfortunately. Yeah. But uh, we just got to be prepared. I was thinking about getting that thing up and running, but... I mean, I got... You know, no one's going on to use so. a fucking percussion cap. Old school shit. Besides, it's a 36 caliber. Alright. Well, we can pull a watch tonight if we have to, or... Just keep an eye out what's going on around here. Matt right. called me over to, uh... Stay with you, give you some company, so... I can use it. I just got a bad feeling. What's that? It's an M712. Where'd you get that? Had it back when I had the, the old business. Oh, right, the, yeah, yeah. Twin Aries yeah. armory. Love it. It's, it's full auto. Switches, switch in here and go from full auto from this side, normal fire. Jams on full auto though. Well, that's no good. Yeah. And it's impractical. So, yeah. Without a butt stock, it's useless. Yeah. So, semi automatic. Oh, that's what I prefer right now. This. It probably jumps all around on you. Uh huh. And because, you know, it's rear end reciprocating, and that hammer fucking smacks you in the back of your hand, you're going to feel it. So, mm -hmm. you got to hold it kind of wonky. It's weird. I don't really like this thing. So. So for sale if you're interested. Nah, man. Just use this wall deco. No, no thanks. All right. Yeah. <laughs> the fuck is that? Joe, get ready. Rocks, no. Got it. are going to kill this thing. Remember last time, right? Well, we don't have any more bullets left, so what's the use of this? Joe, careful. Watch out for his hand. and touch my chest. Can't let it happen the next time. Nope. I think I have a plan. Shit. This thing just doesn't freaking quit. No, it doesn't. Rock, no, both of them.
Joe. Joe! Joe! Is he? My brother's dead because you're fucking done. Yo, wait, what? Oh my fuck. Holy fuck. That's a soul stone. And that's a healing stone. No. Yes. The healing stone, dude. Um, let me think, let me think. Let me think. Uh, fuck, 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 I have an idea. Um, not one of you know, just stupid fucking crazy ideas. I have an idea. <clears throat>
Yo. <coughs> what the hell happened? Uh, um, I, I, I saw the Peace Lord get you, dude. What's his problem? The Peace Lord got you, dude. What do you mean? It had its hand on your chest, dude. You don't, oh my. No. How did you know how to do that? Do what? I, I, I don't know. I just thought his soul, because your soul stone. I don't know, dude. I just figured the peace lord got you, dude. It took your fucking soul. I saw it with my own eyes. I watched you die. Then I was gonna rip him apart. Put your soul back into your body because your body's a host. And I, I figured, like, the, I figured the healing stone would bring you back because your your soul is now in your body. I I don't know. I just figured it would work like that. I guess. I guess it did. Are you all right? Yeah. I just feel a little off. Was it dead? It dropped the stone, so yeah, it is dead. There's a bright side to everything, yes. It stones, it dropped the stone, so it's dead. We killed it, we did it. I think, you, you, I think we're good, right? Sure hope so. I don't think the peace is the end of our troubles. That's the only problem we ever had. Wouldn't you say? Yeah, but it came from where? The multiverse. Think about it. I think we're fine. I really think we're fine. I think there's a lot yeah, more we're fine. coming our way. Everything's done. You that fine? Was the, that was the final. I don't feel good, to be honest, but I'm alive. And if whatever happened, happened that you guys are saying, then... I don't know. I figured, because the healing stone prevents you from dying, that maybe as I'm putting your soul back into your body, that I would use the healing stone and that would like kind of kickstart you again. It's a good idea and it worked, so. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, what's up? You all right? Yeah, I feel a little better. <laughs> Fucking the claw, yeah. So, do you remember what happened earlier? No, I really still don't. I just remember waking up and it just everything being a disaster. Yeah. Yeah. I was checking out those dig marks in the ground over there. What the fuck happened? I don't know. It was right where I fell. That's all I know. I think it must have been me absorbing the concussion of whatever happened to make me fall. I don't know. You guys say that he launched me, so I'm guessing it was from that. Here, you gonna have this? Why? That's why. Don't tell anyone though, seriously. Uh, Cause I even, I don't know, like what the fuck this- How'd you even get that? So, all right. So when I blasted the Peace Lord with the weapon, um, it actually dropped all the stones that, even yours. So what happened was, I literally watched your soul get taken and it had your soul stone. And then I shot it and this, it literally, dude, caused a shockwave so fucking big that 
my ears literally were ringing and I couldn't hear anything. And then um, I didn't see him. I didn't see him until rocks literally almost freaking killed me. And then they're all right there, all the stones. There's a stone of healing. There's a stone of strength, clarity. And then there's your stone. And then there's another stone that was weird. It was shaped like a soul stone. And then I, I put the rest of them in my pocket. And then I noticed that this came about. And then I didn't find that other stone, so. So it's like you don't even need to watch the teleport anymore. I, the, the Peace Lord can teleport, so I guess I can. Wow. I haven't done anything with it yet, but I'll give it a try at some point. But seriously, though, don't tell anyone. I'll eventually... Where's rocks? Went out in the woods for a little bit. You just missed him. Oh. I don't know. Um... It's already sundown, so... Just be careful, that man. It's That's like a, a power that you don't really want to mess with too much. I mean, you got to yeah. learn how to use it first. I was actually thinking... Cause I, I was actually thinking, now that there's, like, no more Peace Lord, there's, like, no more bullshit that we have to be involved with, I was thinking of actually just going to the multiverse and actually similar to this but setting up setting up like a camp there and you know living there and you know come back here during like my runs you know when i'm is there anything else out there though that's gonna i don't know i don't there can't be because all the journals we found were like the old ones of the tory but those have to be fucking god fucking 70 years old by yeah. now 80 Ancient fucking there's no way he's still alive that, i can tell you that much he was already <laughs> he was already this x amount of years old during world war ii there's no way he'd be alive now i don't i'm not worried about that but uh i don't know i'll be back i'll be back tomorrow i won't say anything but i'll tell rocks when the next time i see her i'll be back i hope you do if shit gets weird i'm gonna have to say something but. yeah if anything happens say something and either way, I'm, I'll just come back tomorrow in the morning. No time, then. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But, I don't know. He might not even be mad about it. He might be more interested in anything. <laughs> because, you know how... It's scary. Not even scary, but, like, almost intriguing. Does Mike know about it yet? Crazy Mike? Uh, yeah, that's right. I'm going to have to talk to him. I haven't talked to him uh, since I left his house <laughs> with the weapon. <laughs> but I'll be there. I'll go there. I'll see All right. You. I'll see you tomorrow, maybe. All right, man. Are you going to teleport out of here, or are you going to... Yeah, I don't know. I'm going to go in the train to get my shit. I'll see you. I'll see you. Be careful, dude. I right, yeah.
fuck? Where the fuck is my sweatshirt? I swear it was buried under here. You fuck better be. I gotta find something. Where is it? What is it? What is it? Yeah, you're looking for it. Oh, 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 There's a reason why I went. Come out here. I'm corrupt. My body's corrupted. Wait, what do you mean by? Mm. I wanted. Here, guys, guys, guys. I wanted to come out here to destroy this thing. Okay. Mm -hmm. Because. If we don't destroy this thing, then our timeline is going to collapse. And if our timeline collapses, then we're all going to end up dying. Okay? Let's get it done, man. Alright. I guess we got nothing left else to lose, so let's just do it. Yeah. But um, next time, be upfront about it.